Lauren Hill's ongoing battle with live performances rages on as she has canceled the North American leg of her miseducation of Lauren Hill 25th anniversary tour. In a statement posted to social media, Ms. Hill blamed the cancellation on media sensationalism over her past troubles for low ticket sales. Last year, I faced an injury that necessitated the rescheduling of some of my shows, Hill wrote. Regrettably, some media outlets penchant for sensationalism and clickbait headlines have seemingly created a narrative that has affected ticket sales for the North American portion of the tour. The trust and faith I have in my intentions and my commitment to my art seem to have been overshadowed by this unfortunate portrayal. In August 2023, Hill announced the tour to celebrate the 25th anniversary of her solo debut, recently named the best album of all time by Apple Music. Along with her old group, the Fugees. She was joined by her bandmates at select dates, such as their performance at the Global Citizen Festival in New York City the following September, but in October, Hill canceled a planned show in Philadelphia at the last minute, citing her need to rest her voice. The show was rescheduled for November 25th, but then on November 22nd, Hill said the remainder of the tour would be postponed until 2024. AS previously reported, Hill and the Fugees inexplicably canceled the revamped tour days before it started. However, Hill assured fans the UK and European legs of the tour are moving forward as planned, noting that audiences there haven't seen the Fugees perform together in over 25 years. Though Hill remains highly respected as an artist, her legacy as a live performer is not held in as high regard. The rapper and singer's tendency to show up late, if she shows up at all, to shows has been a running joke among fans irrespective of media sensationalism. She was recently seen performing live at the BET Awards in June. Performing for my fans is a profound exchange of energy and emotion that excites me every time. Hill continued in her statement, Every show is a piece of my expression and testament to our connection and shared love of music. I can assure you that no one is more disappointed about not being able to perform than I am. Meanwhile, Fellow Fugee Praz Michel was found guilty last April for his involvement in an alleged conspiracy by fugitive Malaysian businessman Joe Lowe and faces up to 20 years in prison, though that doesn't seem to have impacted his ability to tour.